Welcome, my name is Michael, and today we will discuss about SpaceX's Starship SN15 launch. After SN11's crash landing, SpaceX's latest Starship launch ended in yet another disaster, as the SN11 failed to succeed with its landing on March 30th. SpaceX fans had been eagerly anticipating the launch of the SN11, following weeks of delays to the scheduled liftoff. At 2 p.m. BST on March 30, the rocket finally took to the skies from SpaceX Boca Chica facility. While the SN11 cruised at an altitude of 10 kilometers, its rockets slowly shut down mid-flight. With a fourth launch in less than four months, SpaceX and Elon Musk discovered another way how not to land a Starship prototype. Unfortunately for SpaceX, the company could not manage to get the three rockets back on until the SN11 was almost to the ground, where it landed on its side. A huge explosion ensued, as captured by NASA spaceflight, as the SN11 cameras shut down, with debris raining across the launch site. Michael Baylor of NASA spaceflight tweeted. Starship SN11 came down hard. Debris came flying past the NASA space flight camera near the pad and even appeared to knock it a bit. The company would have expect progress on its attempts to successfully land Starship, as the SN8, SN9 and SN10 all also exploded as they touched down. When will the next Starship prototype launch? The next Starship prototype to launch will be the SN15. SpaceX had built the SN12, but parts of it have been scrapped. The SN13 and SN14 had parts made for it, but SpaceX decided to not complete the rockets. Instead, it will jump straight to the SN15, which SpaceX chief Elon Musk says has improved capabilities and will be the company's best chance at landing. As is custom with SpaceX, it has not provided an exact launch date, with fans likely to experience a week's-long wait. Mr. Musk said on Twitter. SN15 rolls to launch pad in a few days. It has hundreds of design improvements across structures, avionics software and engine. Hopefully, one of those improvements covers this problem. If not, then retrofit will add a few more days. While the SN15 will be fitted with small changes, eccentric billionaire Mr. Musk said the next major review will come when the SN20 launches. However, even he is not confident the SN20 will be a complete success, stating the later batch of starships will take a more challenging flight. Mr. Musk added. Next major technology rev is at SN20. Those ships will be orbit capable with heat shield and stage separation system. Ascent success probability is high. However, SN20 plus vehicles will probably need many flight attempts to survive Mach 25 entry heating and land intact. That's for now. If you like this, subscribe to my channel for more upcoming videos. Till then keep watching.